all right guys they're playing some off meta cannon top lane and the idea is is that we're going to be shredding down our opponents going ad cannon with on hit build so every item we build is just gonna Steady. purely destroy them through autos um what we have is pda we got presence alacrity cut the, the grass a demolish and also second wind we also have Dorn's Blade and Ghost and Flash. Now we're currently facing off a rather annoying matchup, I would say. Because we are ranged and we do counter a majority of top laners with this setup. Um, but GP is like one of those matchups which can poke you to death. And can be big trouble depending on how he plays, of course. So we're going to have to be very smart with how we approach him. Okay. We just spoken to death. <laughs> AD cannon is incredibly cheesy because you do a lot of damage through autos, but also your Q early game does a lot of damage, and your WE gets a stun uh, if you all combine it together, which really gives you that strong lane. You have your E, which gives you attack speed. Which makes AD Cannon even better. Your W is also scaling. Uh, which once again improves it even more. Let's do it. <laughs> he's trying to cue me but he's failing every time. <laughs> Too bad buddy. Oh man. We can dive him already. Like he's already too low. Not bad. Well, this is going to be a free kill. Unfortunately, we're getting ganked. See you later. It would have been clean if he actually got it. But I suppose he's probably dead. Probably is. Hmm. Yeah, we cannot turn, unfortunately. Man, we are like, uh, we were about to like kill him straight away, but then unfortunately, we get stopped immediately. Really unfortunate. Three minutes in, Gangplank, I mean, uh, already gets a gank by Graves. Okay. Unfortunate. You know, I, I keep saying this, guys, but if I play off-meta top laners, I get 10 times ganked more. Like, it's, um, people, their behavior changes as soon as they see, like, a weird pick or, like, an off-meta pick most of the time. Gotcha, buddy. So the plan in this game is that we're going to be maxing my W because W gives AD scaling, right? Every time you put a point into it, it's going to be better scaling and also gives more damage. And after maxing W, we're going to be maxing E for attack speed. So every time we hit E, we're going to get more and more and more attack speed. The more points, the more attack speed. So that's the, um, that's the idea of this game. So you can already like imagine like how this setup is going to work. Um, ultimate is not going to do much damage. It's going to be more like a, uh, an ultimate to defend ourselves. It really won't do anything. Nice try. He's really trying to hit the Qs. <laughs> you can tell for sure. Like he's trying to. Quite interesting. Oh, there's a ward of course. Nice. Of course, he's trying to hit the Q again. The Qs, they do a lot of damage right now because he's got... Uh, obviously, he has the uh, the Sheen right now, so it's going to be a bit different. We're actually getting a new new. Hmm. Didn't land, okay. It's fine. We could probably dive him. Nice. 
Unfortunately, we're getting another game. <laughs> oh man, my my uh <laughs> my auto attacks. <laughs> They're doing so much damage already. This is really not a fun setup to play against. I can already imagine like the pain that Gangplank is going through. It's definitely not a fun time to play against, I can tell you for sure. He's not enjoying the game. Let's go back. No one wants to play against an uh, against an AD cannon. It's, it's, not, it's not fun to play against, man. <laughs> Alright, let's go Kraken Slayer. This one, and then we also go for attack speed. We also go for this one. All right. So far, he's got a sheen, and he also has like two long swords. All right, cool. Now we also have like boots, so we can chase him better. Gotta stack the wave up. Wait, what is he doing? Step. Oh! Oh! He actually lived. Okay. Interesting. He lived. Hmm. I thought that last auto attack was going to kill him. It's okay, though. We'll get him next time, then. This is um gonna be a good one. I, okay, yeah, you already got him. Yeah, he's dead. <laughs> AD cannon, <laughs> let's go, man. I, I I'm telling you, these guys are not having fun, especially gangplank. Just getting kited down on the on the long range, getting stunned and everything. He's not able. He's not even able to hit the barrels. Good gang from Nunu. Really good one. I'm getting ganked again. Yeah. I might still die. He's gonna hit R, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, he's trying to hit it. Thankfully, I ran out. Okay. I was aboard like a lot of gold, so I'm pretty happy that I didn't die. Thanks to the Nunu. He, uh, fix it for me. Let's go this one. And we build this. So yeah, so far we gain quite a bit of attack speed from E. Like an enormous amount. 50%. Right? And it's an ability that allows us to, to, to chase. Or I mean to chase or kai backwards. Um, and in fact it also even gives a stun if you can hit like the, the full combo. That is a pretty great job. Also the wave fear with that is also nice. In combination with E of course. <laughs> yeah, my Q is not being maxed, so it does it doesn't really do damage. I have this weird feel that I'm about to be ganked. I don't know. Something's telling me. He's currently mid, so I don't need to worry about him anymore. Ok, 
Okay, let's start Chuff. Thank you. Free gold. Thank you. Man, Ghost is such a powerful spell. Like, it is legitimately so good in, on certain champions, man. <laughs> Goodbye. See you later. Lilia doesn't know. She's going the other way. She actually ran off that way. What? Okay. Yeah, I'm getting away for free right now. Unbelievable. Can't believe I'm walking away like that, to be honest. <laughs> hey, Simster, thank you for the subprime. Thank you, man. Hey, welcome to the sub family. Ooh, my damage. I could have killed him. Now I can finally get my Kraken Slayer, so things will uh, change for good now. For good now. And here we go, guys. Can I just give some uh, some? some I, I got something to say. This game, like we are having a Nasus mid lane, guys. Can you believe it? And it's actually working. Like that's, uh, in my opinion, it's one of the worst things. Is like picking Cinch mid lane. It's actually working for him. Unbelievable. I would feed if I play, play Nasus mid lane, man. But the Nasus mid lane is so terrible. Gives me nightmares. Well, finally, like, we can play the game now, because now we got Kraken Slayer, so we have, like, a lot of damage now. Nice try. Uh, yeah, I, I couldn't, like, fit in my last auto attack, unfortunately. Oh, Jin's top lane now. Seems like they are swapping lane. Sure. Sairi of the East. Hey, you too. Thank you for the subprime. Hey, welcome to the sub family. Thanks, man. I need like a bit more for the, the extra attack speed. I think I'm going to stay around for it. There you go. All right, so 1v1-ing pretty much anyone this game should not be that hard to do right now since I can just E in and then hit my R. They will get stunned and I auto attack them to death. If they run, I, I can even ghost. So that's not really an issue right now anymore. Now I just got to see if I can uh, push the wave and get like 1v1s. If not, we can roam mid lane and, you know, group up. Oh man, the attack speed. Let's do it. Is there like more I can take? I actually want to see if I can get this one. <laughs> oh man, we're like shredding the tower so fast. <laughs> this is worth it for me. Got it. 
dead. I can probably take another one. Uh, or, yeah, they're coming top now, so I'm forced to go back anyway. Okay, let's go back. You enjoying the Riven videos? Helped you? Also, you enjoyed the variety you play in top? Hey, thanks, man. Well, yeah, you notice now, I pretty much take anything top lane nowadays, man. From meta champions to like, uh, to like the weirdest stuff you can possibly imagine. I play it all. <laughs> I make everything work. Every champion. <laughs> Including weird stuff like AD cannon. You know. Hey, that camp's taken. We could probably run straight mid right now and just force towers. Is there a camp here? No. Okay. I can see if I can kill Gangplank. He's like kind of overextending a bit. My damage. <laughs> I waste every spell for this. It's so worth it, man. <laughs> my ult. My ghost. My flash. No problem, man. Oh, I got clean up. Yeah, that's like one of the um, only counters to AD cannon. If you get stunned and then bursted, you're basically dead. There's not much you can do. <clears throat> I suppose we could build more tanky like later on in the game, but that also means we uh, we can build less items to, you know, shred them right. Maybe like last item we go black lever, and that's gonna make us really tanky, and also gets the 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 shredding. So I think I'm gonna sell my Doran's plates. I got the blade. Here we go. He's going for my tower. Will he continue to push? I doubt it. We like so farmed up. Oh, he's actually still here. Okay. Whoops. Oh, they got the dragon actually. Man, this feels really satisfying. Alright, okay. Interesting. Yeah, like I said, we are kind of weak to all ins. Like, as in, like, burst. That's something to keep in mind. I might, I might still have to build something against this. I don't know. Still got to figure something out. Um, either way, the next item we're going to go with right now is going to be an item you guys probably won't expect. It's going to be a Wits End. Now, specifically building that for attack speed, damage, and MR against Lilia. And then also, of course, the, the effect which we're looking for. We're looking for on hit, so we're going to build that next. And after Wit's End, we will probably go into Nash's Tooth. I know it sounds weird because why AP when you're going to spill, but again, like we need on hit here, so.
I think I'm probably just gonna stick to top lane for the, the rest of the game. <laughs> probably. Ma uh, mainly avoiding the, the team fights. Just having that perma splitting uh, mental. Wait, what? Okay. <laughs> Yeah, right. Okay, sure. But I instantly died, man. That barrel equaled like two, three of my health bar. <laughs> Gangplank is such a such a strong top at the moment. Like his barrels can kill you instantly late game, man. He's not even that fat, he just has like a lot of farm. He's like two items. <laughs> yeah, I love how you guys mentioned like, yeah, GP buffed. Yeah, yeah. I know, right? They're, they're buffing Gangplank. I, I, like the moment I saw Gangplank buffs, I was like, wait, what, what are you doing? I, I don't understand, man. <laughs> Arita games came with like Gangplank buffs. Oh, <laughs> Camp is taken, sure. Steady. Also taken, I guess. Oh, man, the attack speed. Alright, let's go back. Yeah, unfortunately, Grace, uh, Grace is like top lane, like forcing all towers and stuff. I might actually consider staying. I could probably kill her. Thank you. I'm probably dead. I'm going to get killed from the back here. Probably. Yep. Yeah. I I had I I uh, I I knew it, man. Like Jin was already here. Like Jin or Jin also has like like eight kills at the moment. He's also huge. He can outrange me, so it's really hard for me to do something against him. My idea this game is not working out as I wanted to. Like, we have a lot of damage, we can kill pretty much anyone. But we are trying to split push, but we get, like, killed on the side lanes every single time. Mainly in 1v2s. up because they are all here Steady. really wish I could like split more this game yeah like I said gameplay just waiting for someone to show up it was quite obvious we got a Morgana up here but this this guy can kill me with one barrel right now if I go in I'm dead man Like, the, the biggest power spike is we've had that early game. Right now, it's going to be a bit, a bit more challenging. It's 
Let's get this camp here. I'm not sure if I will uh, if I will split too much. Maybe see if we can get some more opportunities. I'm not gonna jump into that. I was thinking about all inning with with the uh, with the plant, but I'm quite happy I didn't because he would burst me. <laughs> nice, got the assist. That's awesome. So now we are going to go for a build that you guys are absolutely not going to expect, but we're going to be going with Nash's Tooth right now. So once again, we can grab more, um, a little bit more damage on my abilities, but also have on hits um, <laughs> and have more attack speed. So. I mean, we're getting kind of close to, like, full attack speed. So, after Nash's dude, we will definitely go for Black Leaper. Random Lilia, okay. We got a new new bot lane though. Jin has a lot of damage. Steady. Okay. Let's gotta keep pushing mid now. Okay. I want to get into like splitting top, man. I really want to see if I can kill Gameplay by myself. Guys, this feels so satisfying. You guys gotta try AD Cannon by yourself. You guys really gotta try it out. It feels... Um, it feels kind of weird at first because it's like a total different way of playing Cannon. But once you're being used to it... All you need to know is that your ultimate is more like a defensive tool. What? 1900 damage? Guys, I died in 1.75 seconds. But in in fact, like it wasn't even 1.75 seconds. He actually there was there was an auto before. I find it so funny when when Riot is talking about like how they are you know, nerfing the... Well, they're thinking about nerfing damage because it's, like, so busted, right? Then you look at things like this. You're just getting bursted down 2,000 damage in, like, less than a second. And pretty much their entire team comp is able to do this. Like, everyone can kill each other in, like, one second nowadays. I remember when League of Legends was uh, in the tank meta. 
and they were complaining about how tanky everyone was. Now it's the opposite. Now everyone's getting killed instantly. Ah, oh, he's actually gale forcing away. He's gonna burst me again. Craig's doing grace things. You see what he's doing? What a bad fight. This this is not good actually. I use my E so I have more attack speed, but yeah. Man, this is going awful. We're losing towers and stuff. I don't think uh, it's it's gonna be hard to to defend this now. Thousand seventy three damage. Whew. That's like one Q, man. It's like sixty percent of my health bar. Yeah, I, I hopefully this is not the game. Yeah, I suppose it's probably lost. Either way, like, it might be a loss. It was incredibly interesting playing AD Cannon top lane. I'm glad I actually did this one. This was actually really interesting, you know. Either way, guys, this is Cannon top lane. Thanks so much for watching today's YouTube vid, and I'll see you next time. Peace.